using Javadoc for Python documentation. I am currently beginning with Python and I have a strong PHP background and in PHP I have took the habit of using Javadoc as a documentation template. I was wondering if Javadoc has its place as doc string documentation in Python. What are the established conventions and or official guild lines here? For example is something like this too elaborate to fit in the Python mindset or should I try to be as concise as possible? And if I am a bit too exhaustive should I go with something like this instead, where most of the documentation doesn't get printed through the underscore doc underscore method? Have a look at the restructured text, also known as REST, format, which is a plaintext slash docstring markup format, and probably the most popular in the Python world. And you should certainly look at Sphinx, a tool to generate documentation from restructured text, used for e.g. the Python documentation itself. Sphinx includes the possibility to extract documentation from the docstrings in your code, see sphinx.extension.u. To doc and recognizes REST field lists following certain conventions. This has probably become, or is becoming, the most popular way to do it. Your example could look as follows. Or extended with type information. Follow Google Python style guide. Note that Sphinx can also parse this format using the Napoleon extension, which will come packaged with Sphinx 1.3, this is also compatible with PEP 257. Example taken from the Napoleon documentation linked above. A comprehensive example on all types of doc strings here. The standard for Python documentation strings is described in Python Enhancement Proposal 257. The appropriate comment for your method would be something like Take a look at Documenting Python, a page aimed at authors and potential authors of documentation for Python. In short, Restructured text is what's used for documenting Python itself. The developer's guide contains a REST primer, style guide, and general advice for writing good documentation. <laughs>